didn't want them to like mess up the design. We also got the roasted. I ordered this bag and it came in this little cute dust bag. I'm so thankful to have like this large group of friends like you guys. Hi guys, it is currently 11.52 and recently I haven't been going to bed on time and I haven't been drinking my water, not a very hot girl summer of me but recently I have been having a busier schedule just trying to plan out all of my trips but even with like a busier schedule, something that I always do before I go to bed is to just spend time for myself in the past it has always just been to like go on Instagram on youtube and just scroll for like hours but besides the point something i've been doing instead of going on social media is to just play this game called storington hall i don't play games a lot so i haven't been able to share that many games with you guys on my channel but this is something that i've actually been interested in if you're wondering what it is it is a free-to-play puzzle game available to both ios and android devices well it's a romantic plot line about this family that inherits a mansion and everything seems well until jane the youngest daughter finds a bunch of shades mysteries around the mansions like all the plot lines the love affairs the secrets i think will make it interesting for anyone the adventures of the game will invite you to be the creator of the plot line the puzzles are very fun to play and you also get to decorate the mansion and make the game your own mini world you can also throw balls and get dressed up like there's just so much you can do on top of that you can also play this game with your friends to solve puzzles together so i'm playing the game right now on my phone and i just need to click on this blue star to complete the task that i am asked to do like honestly it's just a great way to kill time in my opinion so if you guys are looking for something to keep you entertained throughout the summer i really recommend this game to you guys so you guys can check out the link in my description box to download the app and you guys can also use this qr code to get this bonus of infinite lives for six hours so i hope you guys love the game as much as i do and you guys can let me know what you guys think of the game down in the comment section and i'll make sure to read those and i'll see you guys tomorrow good night <laughs> Good morning everyone today is such a nice day it has been rainy for like the past week but today is sunny and it's very bright so i hope to have a productive day today i just completed my makeup this morning recently i've been so obsessed with like the manga lash style so i just apply some individual lashes as well and i think they look pretty good but i did my makeup because i need to go renew my driver's license so i need to retake pictures for that so i hope they don't turn out ugly i swear to god they always do but i still need to do my hair so i'll show you guys how i do that because recently i I started to build a hair routine so I recently purchased this Revlon hair styler it's like a blow dryer and a styler all in one and my hair is kind of damp because I took a shower this morning so I think it'll be perfect but I heard that it fries your hair so you need to use a heat protectant spray <laughs> So this is my outfit of the day. I feel like I've worn the same outfit like at least three times in my vlogs, but it's really comfy and cute. So I got this top from Brandy Melville and these pants from Aritzia. These were definitely overpriced, but they're so cute for the summertime. Okay, so we just finished taking the photos. I'm gonna get the ID in like 21 days so I can't show you guys because I'll be in Korea. I didn't think this through properly, but I think this time my ID looked pretty decent. So I'm kind of really happy about that. But we're gonna head to a cafe now because I haven't eaten anything all day and it's a really hot day. So we're just gonna go chiller. We also got the roasted beef sandwich because we're pretty hungry.
We also got some takeout for my brother and my dad. So I'm at Ikea because I need new mattress covers for my bed. It's like all ripped inside and for the longest time I just didn't care to change them. Today is such a hot day. I'm like sweating so bad. Today I'm going to be taking 500,000 pictures with my cake that I had pre-ordered a few days ago. Um, I have to go pick it up in a few hours. But I wanted to quickly show you guys a makeup products that I picked up on the way back home. I got this Milk Hydro Grip Primer. I heard a lot of good reviews about this and apparently it's really good for humid weather. I'm literally going to Korea when it's the hottest time of the year. And summers in Korea are brutal. They get so humid and hot. So hopefully this can make my makeup last. And I also got this blush. I've been wanting this Rare Beauty blush for the longest time. But they were always sold out every time I checked out Sephora's. But I picked up the one in the shade Bliss. I'm going to be reapplying this. I applied some in the car. But I'm going to be putting some more on before I take pictures. And I also got a few lashes to bring with me to Korea. As well as a new lash glue. So it is currently 4.43 and my cake pickup is for 5 so I'm gonna head out right now to go pick that up. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it already. I should have posted it on Instagram by now but I'm so excited for you guys to see it in this video. I think you guys will love it. So I just completed my hair and my makeup. I just lightly curled my hair with my hair straightener and I put this ribbon in my hair. Um, I usually like to take my pictures in dimmer lighting, like not dimmer, but with my room lighting and not natural lighting. But today I'm going to try something different because I think the lighting right now is like really pretty. This is what the cake looks like. I added like these little heart angels on the side, which I think is so cute. I asked for a simpler design this time because I didn't want them to like mess up the design. So if you guys have stuck around for like the 100k, 400k pics, you guys know I usually do a lot more designs, but I wish I was in Korea for this, but we're here in Edmonton, so. But it's still so pretty, I love it so much. We came to get some dim sum at this Chinese place. It's our first time here. On my way back home, I picked up this package from my mailbox and it's a package from IMGia. I ordered some of their tops a few days ago because they're having a really huge sale. Even though they were on sale, I had to pay an extra $50 for the duties and taxes. So the struggles of living in Canada is we can never get the cute stuff. But anyways, I ordered this bag and it came in this little cute dust bag. Da -da -da -da. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. It's a lot smaller than I was expecting, but I love this little keychain. Yeah, I like this top because it looks like a 
regular tank top with black bolero in the sleeves it looks kind of weird when i hold it up but i'll attach a photo right over here it looked really cute on the model so i got it and i also got this really cute black top it has like a cute little bow at the front it's my favorite it's so cute i'm so excited for korea now If you guys are traveling to Korea in the summertime, I really recommend you guys to pick up some boleros. It's like a knitted cardigan, but just for your arms, so it like goes... It covers your arms, but it's like empty here. Most girls in Korea tend to be more conservative with their outfits, so they don't really like to show their arms a lot. Um, but especially in the summertime when it gets really hot and humid, boleros are the way to go so i have two over here i packed one in my bag already but i have the black one and the gray one so i'm just gonna be bringing these two i do have a projector in my room and i haven't used it in such a long time like in months and because i'm leaving to korea again so soon um i want to use it tonight so i'm gonna go buy myself some fruits because normally i would buy myself some chips and stuff but i've been craving fruits really badly recently so looking so crazy i'm just gonna put this down real quick but i wanted to take a moment to like really sit down and to thank you guys and to just kind of let you guys know how i'm like feeling about hitting 500,000. i started this channel like in 2020 i started this channel around the time coronavirus was becoming a thing and everyone was talking about a school lockdown and i remember just thinking to myself that i need a new hobby because like i know just being at home all the time would definitely make me depressed this was just definitely a creative outlet for me and i've mentioned this before i had a youtube channel back in elementary school literally in grade five exactly um i used to do like gymnastic videos get ready with me for school vlogs and bethany moda was someone that i really truly looked up to and like my life as ava and those vloggers but to kind of have a fan base that looks at me the way that i used to look at my youtube role models is a really like a i don't know like it's like it's something that i've wanted for such a long time and you guys are literally one of the best support systems that i've ever witness i'm so thankful to have like this large group of friends like you guys where we can all just share our passions our interests and like our love for the same foods for the same music for the same aesthetic and i feel like that has a lot more meaning um to me than hitting 500,000. like than just hitting the milestone of 500,000. so so thank you guys and welcome to this community slash family um, I hope you guys stay for a while. So this is what my luggage is looking like. I obviously haven't finished packing yet because I still need to use like my skincare products tomorrow. So I'll be packing those before I actually leave. So I brought my berries that I purchased earlier and I'm not even gonna lie, it tastes really bad. I think I'm now gonna go to bed. It was such a productive day today. I haven't been this productive in such a long time. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog and spending the day with me. But lastly, thank you guys so much for 500,000 again. I am so happy with the community that we are continuing to build and I am so thankful for each and every one of you guys. So I'll see you guys then and I'll see you guys in Korea. Bye guys, thank you, bye. And thanks again to Storington Hall for sponsoring this video. Remember you can install the game using my link in the description box and get a bonus for new players, infinite lives for 6 hours. Enjoy! Bye! Woke up at 11 o'clock, I ain't got no job, what the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck, oh my god, shut the fuck up, I ain't hearing what you gotta say.